and I'm going to show you how to do a bedroll for camp. So what you need is a mat to sleep on. So you can use a piece of foam or a self-inflatable mat like this one. You need a sleeping bag, make sure it's nice and warm, an extra blanket, a pillow, a stuffed animal if you'd like, about 12 feet of rope, and a tarp. So what you want to do first is lay out the tarp nice and flat. So before we go any further, we want to make a slip knot in our rope so that we're not struggling to do it when our bedroll is all rolled up. So what you do first is make a loop and pull it through. This is a knot that can get smaller and bigger with a loop so you can wrap it all the way around your bedroll. You want to fold over these ends. in the other end. Make sure to keep it nice and straight. So now that it's nice and folded, it's time to roll it up. your rope, get your loop, and put it around the bedroll, and tighten it up. Then, take it across, about the same distance from the end, make a corner, wrap it around, loop it through, over your roll and then you loop it through both ropes. And you loop it right where you started again. If you have a lot of rope left over, And then you make more loops like this, through and through the loop, keep going until your handle is long enough and you have a bit of rope on the end. This is probably good. So for the last one, you just put it through and pull it, and then you can tie the two ends together to make. bedroll is ready to go. So the purpose of the bedroll is to keep your bedding nice and dry. It's really important to have a dry bed at camp so you don't get cold and so that you have a comfortable sleep. So this bedroll is nice and waterproofed. The tarp is wrapping completely around. So this one would stay nice and dry. Use is a waterproof stuff set. You can buy these at any outdoor store like Campers Village or Mountain Equipment Co-op. So these are, they come in different sizes and they're waterproofed. 
So you just put all of your bedding inside, roll it up, it has some clips, and that will keep your stuff dry too. The that we don't recommend but often see is the plastic garbage bin. This is not a good idea because it rips easily, it's hard to waterproof, and it can be mistaken for garbage. We don't want to throw your bed away at camp. The other problem with the garbage bag is often it will rip when it's opened and then you have nothing to take your bed home in. Thanks for watching. I hope this was helpful. Have a great camp.